Hi, in this tutorial, I will show you how to select Elementor as a trigger and send data to Bit Integrations actions. At first, open the Bit Integrations dashboard. Now click on Create Integration button to create an integration. Select Elementor as a trigger. Select the form from the drop down list that you connect with actions and wait for a few seconds until the next button is active and click on the next button. After completing these steps, the actions will appear on a new page. Now select any action of your preference that you want to integrate with Elementor. I am selecting in charge. Here you can set the integration name of your preference. To get the API key open your InCharge API console. Now copy the API key and paste it into the integration setting. Now click on the Authorize button after successfully authorizing and click on the Next button. After completing the authorization process, you will find the Tag Field and Map Field option. You will input the tag that was previously created in InCharge. You can input multiple tags with commas. You have to map all the necessary fields with the related InCharge field. By default email field of InCharge will be available. You can also send custom values by mapping your required field. You can now map the form fields with the necessary in charge fields. After mapping the desired fields, click on Next. To save the integration process, Click on Finish and Save. Now go to your form and type some information and submit. After submitting the form, Go to Integration Timeline, where you can check integration success or error status. Now go to InCharge Dashboard and check InCharge People. Thanks for watching.